Williams. White plays a good ball forward, looking for the danger man in Keogh. Edge of the area. Plays it across. Marinkovic throws and scores! Nafoy plays it up to Keogh, who lets it run past. And it opens up again for Perth. Keogh over halfway. Not much in support. He has to hold it up. Waits for the run. Harold into the area. He tries a strike and kills it! Jenny has Keogh outside him. And they work it between the two of them. It's Keogh. Now arriving is Marinkovic. Garcia. Here's Risden. Skips away from Poliak. Still going, Josh Risden. Lays it in for Keogh. What a superb finish from Andy Keogh. Ice cold, the Irishman. And he stunned the crowd here at Parramatta. The glory. Sitting deep now, the Jets allowing Perth to combine. Sydney blocked by Kennedy. McLaren looking for Keogh. Andy Keogh draws first blood here at the Hunter Stadium. Delight for the Irish. They get pushed around a fair bit. The refs. Marinkovic. Flat to delivery this time. Actually looked for offside against Jorvich and didn't get it. Drove it straight into the midriff for his teammate. And the break though for Thwaites, who'll chip it in. His Keogh outside! And there's the goal for Perth Glory! It's Andy Keogh! Just as he did in Geelong, he does again! And Andy Keogh. Perfect from the penalty spot thus far. Measured build up. Once the coda commits, and it's 1 1 just like that. For the history of goals, this fixture. It was all there for him to go on his own. This ball through the middle. Bruce is again closed down by Risden that time. Nice turn from Zatkovic. Marinkovic immediately trying to release Keo, and he's in behind Leia. Across the front of the defender intelligently. Andy Keo puts Perth in front. What a strike! With the ball, not how much you've got the ball. Perth Glory has certainly shown it there. As you mentioned, it was a great flick on from Andy Keo. Hasn't been involved too much in this game, but it just took that one little bit of class to play Harold in, who's got another opportunity here as well. Plays in, repays the favour. Andy Keo has scored. The Glory lead at 2 0 in the deck of an eye. against Janjanovic and Keo scores a bit of fortune for the Irishman but it doesn't matter and Perth Glory in front with Keo strong with Sigmund breaks for De Silva now Griffiths Marinkovic Risden needs a good delivery and it is wonderful delivery and Andy Keo ends the goal drought level terms and to score his second goal for his new club Andy Keogh for Perth and scores how cheeky was that <laughs> Jamie Young well he sold him he went right and Keogh cool as you like and good work by the uh, Brisbane defense in uh, the captain Matty Smith this is Risden Looking to maybe try one, no. Run out of space. Now here's a chance for Keo. On his left back, Keo. And it's there for Fletcher. He's done it again. The Irish international has scored his second for the match. Perth have done it twice, coming down from behind, coming back from behind. So could this be the one? Scott Jamison with the corner. Here's the delivery. Up they go. Here's the header. I think North Queensland from memory, Harry. Every goalkeeper has a striker lurking somewhere deep within, don't they? Well, they all want the glory at both ends, don't they? Saving penalties and scoring goals as well.
Nichols's pinch possession, or rather it was gifted to him. Dangerous ball, wonderful goal! That is stunning! The delivery from Nichols is beautiful to watch and the finish was just as good from Kia. Jesus Gomez, uh, McLaren, ridica privirea din pământ, uh, îi transmite balonul lui uh, Sydney. Porca Wriston. Este ajutat uh, de Ferreira, Sydney, scurt, uh, până la McLaren cu offside, uh, shoot și gol, uh, gol valabil, Kia uh, restabilește egalitatea al minutul uh, 57. One hundred and seventy-four. The attendance yeah. this evening at Molyneux. I'm sure, that's I'm sure that's better than most teams in the championship. Better than most, but it's probably the uh, lowest attendance for a league game for a while. Here's uh, Ngessen spinning away from his marker there and tries a weak left-footed effort, but he deflects back to a middle player. Now Wood spins away from his marker. He's in, in on the edge of the uh, box, and he's yeah. in the goal. Millwall have broken. Only times looks as though he's going to lose. Uh, possession of that but just managed to unload it to Andy Keogh here's the corner it's a flicked off the head of Mark Beavers chase out there for Malone now can work himself uh, an opening to try and he was fouled there surely Scott Malone he still managed to get the ball turns it back to uh, Andy Keogh and draws it in and the one in front Andy Keogh from the angle but a lot Clayton does, loose and in, Leeds United lead, Andy Keogh sweeps it home for it. So normally a very very good defensively, are all at sea, that's a great burst from White and he pulls it back and there's Keogh's first involvement, he lays it off and he gets himself back involved, there's some good blocks in there but he sniffs out the chance Andy Keogh, he's in the right place at the right time. A.D. White does ever so well. This is good defending, isn't it? It's Dunk that gets the block in. Leeds get a little bit of a lucky break. There's no doubt about it with the way that ball deflects and lands at Andy Keogh's feet. But 